All right, guys, today at home, phase two arms. Man, this is my fourth workout with y'all today, so forgive me if I'm breathing hard, but I've, uh, I've been working with you guys, so I definitely get these workouts are effective. So what we have now is we're gonna do the same thing we usually do, 15 reps for just about everything, and we're gonna do 30 seconds of activity in between each exercise, activity of choice, okay? So as long as you're busting it, as long as you're moving, at least 30 seconds between your exercises. All right, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it. I got my heavy dumbbells today, so I'm gonna be struggling with you. This is an exercise we're actually doing more than 15 reps. We're gonna do 21, okay? So you're gonna have your palms facing out, and you're gonna start off just by curling all the way up and all the way down. There's one and two, nice and slow, just like I'm doing here. Three, four, and we're just gonna be going to seven on this. Five, six, and seven. At the top here, we're gonna go halfway down and then all the way up. There's one and two and three. Four, three more. One, two, and three all the way down. And now we're just gonna go halfway up for seven. So up halfway and down. There's one, there's two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Woo! Got the heavy dumbbells today. All right, next. We're gonna go into our activity. I'm always doing jumping jacks, as you could probably see throughout these videos. That's kind of my go-to. You do whatever you'd like, all right? Go ahead and get started. 30 seconds here. more seconds. Keep busting it. Keep busting Five more seconds. You got it. You got it. Keep it up. Keep it up. And relax. Good, 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 good. All right. Next, we're going to go into bench dips. Okay, so for bench dips, you are free to do bench dips with me. A lot of people need to modify on this one, so if you need to modify, grab a dumbbell, and we're just going to do those overhead dumbbell tricep extensions. All right, for bench dips, we're just gonna go with 15. For overhead tricep extensions, just do both arms and do 15 as I count, okay? Go ahead and get started. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, five more, five, four, three, two, and one. Very good, very good. All right, we're gonna go back to our activity here. I'm going back to my jumping jacks. You do whatever you'd like. And again, like I've said in the videos past, just try to work your way up every time you work out. If you find yourself just barely jogging in place. Don't feel discouraged about that. You're moving, you're active, whereas you probably weren't, you know, several weeks ago. Just try to build your way up, and maybe one day you'll be running pretty fast in place. Or you might even be doing burpees. And relax, good. All right, next we're gonna go with a Zotman curl. What a Zotman curl is, it's basically, you're gonna do a hammer curl up, which is both palms facing one another. When you bring it up, you're gonna twist where your palms are facing straight up, and then go down. Twist, palms facing one another. Up, twist, palms facing up, and down. Twist. Two, and two. Three, and three. Just go with me. Four, and four. No need to rush. Five, and five, six, and six, seven, and seven, eight, eight, nine, 
nine, 10, 10, five more, five, five. Remember to control it as you're coming down. And four, that's a very important part of the rep. Three, two, last one, we're up and then we're down. Very good. All right, gonna go back into our activity. I'm gonna go back to my jumping jacks. And let's go ahead and get started. True story here, I recorded about half of this video and realized I was doing the wrong workout. So I'm on a time budget today anyway. I had to restart the whole thing. So I, I really, uh, I've really been working it today, but it's good. You know, it's my birthday and I'll probably be eating some piece of cake today. Flexible diet here, right? And relax, good. All right, we're gonna be moving on to triceps again. We're gonna do a single arm overhead tricep extension. You could do double, but I prefer single uh, just because I can focus a little bit more on the, uh, the muscle that I'm working. So you're gonna put one dumbbell in the air. I like to support this arm so it doesn't go too far forward. I wanna keep it back. So we're gonna bring that dumbbell down and then extend overhead. Dumbbell down, extend overhead, there's two. So you're gonna to wanna to keep this elbow stationary. Keep it locked in the same place. Avoid this elbow going too far forward. If it's doing that, you're probably using too heavy of a weight. There's seven, and honestly for these, it doesn't take a whole lot. And nine, I'm using a 15 right now, 10, and it's burning pretty good. 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, very good. Once you build up enough discipline, you don't have to keep that arm there, but sometimes it's just a good security to have. And go ahead and begin. There's one, and two, and three, and four, five. I've worked one-on-one -on -one with several people, and we do burnouts on these sometimes. So we get to the end of the sets, and, uh, and then it's enough to have them lift their arms over their over their head after we're done. I love it. That's 12, and that's 13, and that's 14, and that's 15. Very good. I'll try not to get too talkative. I know you'll like when I count. I don't blame you. We're gonna go back into our activity and begin. <laughs> I don't know if you guys are like me either, but after I get done working out. I like, I'm ready to eat, um, and one of my pretty much everyday things is egg whites with sweet peppers and a little bit of cheese, so that's all that's on my mind right now. It's going to be my birthday breakfast. You know, that's special right now. And go ahead and relax. Alright, we're going to go with hammer curls with a static hold. So, I'm going to try to go heavy on these. We'll see how I do. So hammer curl with a static hold. You're gonna hold one dumbbell at 90 degrees while you curl with the other. And then you'll just switch rolls, okay? So there'll be 15 on each arm. You're gonna go ahead and bring your left arm up to 90, curl with the right. There's one, two, three, and on one of my workouts, four, five. I accidentally only did 10. So I may have bit up more than I can chew here. Eight. Nine, ten, five more, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold that right arm. Woo! I'm feeling it. One, two, three, four, five, ten more, ten, nine, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. My gosh. Whoo, my arms are on fire. All right, we're going to go back to our activity. No, I'll have one more exercise after this. And begin. Yeah, that was quite a jump. 
You know, it's crazy, but when I get myself on camera, I feel like I give a better effort anyway because I'm trying to be a, a positive role model for you. So, you know, some days I might have given up before 15 reps. So maybe getting a workout buddy would be a benefit for you just to give you that extra push. All right, one more exercise and it is a dumbbell school crusher. We've done these before. I'm gonna tighten my collars here real quick. And all you're gonna do is lay down on your back, dumbbell straight up, and together, you're gonna keep your elbows locked out and stationary. Just gonna bring those dumbbells slowly to your forehead. Once they reach your forehead, extend back up. Elbows locked in the same place. And two, and three, very good. Four, nice and slow, right with me. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Let's get five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! All right, guys. That is going to be it for one round. What I want you guys to do now is finish off your other rounds just by starting the video over and just going along with me again. Um, as you can see, I did just about every exercise. I think every exercise with dumbbells, but you do have resistance bands. Don't be afraid to break those out and use those instead, especially for some of the curl stuff. Um, resistance bands are awesome. Just try to mix it in uh, where you need it. Thanks for watching.